Okay, on to step three. We're gonna go ahead and Clico and then rivet together hinge bracket one, uh, the rear spar stiffening plate, the rear spar channel, there's two pieces of those, and the center channel rear. Smash them all together and rivet them. All right. You do not rivet these 12 holes. There's six on the left, six on the right. I've gone ahead and marked them with a Sharpie as DNR for do not rivet. There are two different size rivets on this step. The black Clicos toward the inner part are 4.0 by 10 millimeter rivets. They're domed rivets. The copper uh, Clicos that I'm putting there on the outside they're 3.2 by 8 millimeter rivets, also domed. All right, guys, uh, Christopher has a question about the Rotex 915 IS. Uh, he says, if it accepts both 100 low lead and 91 mo gas, then what happens if you fill with mo gas and land at a field that only serves 100 low lead? Can you mix a few gallons of mo gas already in the tank with the 100 low lead? What about the reverse case? Even if possible, are there any side, uh, negative side effects? Um, yeah, that's uh, not really a problem. You can mix 100 low lead. You can mix it with 91 octane. Go, uh, you know, so a lot of people use 100 low lead just out of convenience. Um, they do have you change the oil a little more regular. Uh, that way, it keeps the, the drivetrain and the gearbox uh, from gumming up with the lead uh, but there's really no side effects uh, thanks for the great question Christopher follow me on Instagram at Brad's aviation channel follow my builders blog at bradslingtsi.wordpress.com step 3 took 1 hour 15 minutes Total time on the empennage so far is 11 hours, 20 minutes. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, hit the bell, that way you'll receive notifications. And once again, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week.